Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Because we know that you are very influential in yeah. the like, Nigerian scene, especially things to do with the diaspora. Yeah. I just wanted to know, how do you think that your film will help and is helping in improving the growth of the diaspora as a whole? My film is not really for diaspora, it's for the world at large. It's a story that has never been touched in Nollywood. And it's something that happens that people keep silent. So I felt that this is the medium I can send a message across the world that what these men are doing is wrong. And if a child is a victim, she will know what to do. Brilliant. And what are your expectations, not just from today, mm. but you know, as a whole, from this movie? I believe that anybody who watches this movie goes to Facebook to write about it, that they like it, I think the world will want to watch it. And it's a message that you believe that they yes. will Yes, they will. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I would say rather very impressive um, what we set out to do the movie. One of the reasons I actually did the movie with Fiora because she's a PR person and I know she will go all out. Like uh, the people say, your movie is only as good as the publicity you give it. And it's a very good movie, so she's giving it good publicity and you know. Uh, bless God for the turnout. It's that's quite impressive. And what are your expectations for the movie? You know? uh, I expect the movie to be shown. I expect people to watch the movie. And I expect people to live happy. And do you think mm. it's an award-winning movie? movie? Well, it should be able to win some awards. And it shouldn't be able to win some awards. So, <laughs> let's just see how it goes. So, Fantastic. It's mm. always good to see you. It's always a pleasure. Can I give you another one? So, we're here with the DOP, which apparently stands for Director of Photography. I learn something new every day. So, um, of uh, Shameful Deceit. And, Mr. DOP, please tell us your name, so I don't keep calling you Mr. DOP. My name is Nelson Spike. Brilliant. Thank you, Mr. Spike. And yes. how did you find filming, shooting the whole film? The whole film, no easy. The problem when we get, we say, you know, say when money not too plenty, it get as it be. But the money when we get, we got to work with it to make sure, say, we get moving. So that's the waiting we do. And more so, you know, say the movie in a drama. Yes. And when you come to drama, the way they light them, they're different. So the way you light a white side, the light will put them now, comedy, they're different. Yeah. So we had to light it in such a way that we also capture the mood. So, uh, but um, eventually we got that. Okay. Well, thank you very much. I know we're out of time now, but I'm hoping to catch up with you after the movie so you can tell us a bit more because it sounds very interesting. <laughs> no problem at all. Thank you, Respect. Nelson Spy. <laughs> Good to <stuff> you. <laughs> oh, the pleasure is mine, lovey. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Good to see you. Oh, okay. and, um, Well, it's a good story, um, and I feel it's got a big message for people out there, especially for the society. Uh, there are a lot of abusive fathers out there who abuse their daughters. No matter, please, no matter how beautiful your daughters are, please don't abuse your daughters. Don't touch your daughters. All right? You know, it's a terrible thing. There's a terrible negative repercussion at the end of the day if you're used to doing things like that, because there's no way the secret will come to the light. And then that girl will never, never love you. She would hate you for, the, for as long as you leave. So, I mean, this story has got message, is informative, is educative, and it's going to keep the audience on the edge of their seats all through. That's fantastic. Yeah. And so, do you think this is an award-winning movie? Oh, yes. I can smell it. <laughs> I can smell it already. That's brilliant. Thank you very much. For your Welcome, time. lovey. Thank you. Thank you, darling. Cheers. My name is Victoria Inama Okri. I'm, I'm a very good friend of Theodore's. Brilliant. And mm. so far, coming here today, you saw the crowd that turned up for this premiere. Yeah. What did you think? Well, um, this is what I expect. Anyway, from Theodora. I mean, you know she used to be in the pageantry yeah. business and yeah. all that. So yeah. she knows quite. And she's a PR guru and yes. all that. So I didn't expect less. So I, I'm really And so impressed. what are you expecting out of the movie tonight? Well, more than anything else, I want the movie to be very educative, um, especially informing people of what is actually going on out there. Because um, it's an issue that people don't really want to talk about because of the shame or embarrassment. But the truth is that it happens. And it happens in our black community. 
yes, white people, they do come out and talk about it once in a while, but the black people always keep it locked in, you know. But hopefully, after watching this movie, I just want to say that anyone this thing is happening to, any young person out there, big girl or boy, you could be, you know, abused anyhow, the person should just go to the right place and seek help. Brilliant. Yeah. Well, thank you very much for that. And, you know, I know everybody's about to go in and see the movie. We'll catch you outside once the movie's done and you Definitely. can tell us your take on it. Definitely. Thank you. Yeah, I'm Free Boys Radio. And I would say this is one of the best films made by a wonderful Nigerian lady. And I hope more of this is going to come out of her. Sure. Beautiful film. We enjoyed watching it. Beautiful film. We enjoyed watching it. Out. Watch her movie any day, any time again. Fantastic. Dynamic. You know, that was totally inspirational, but not just inspirational. It's shown what's going on in our community and in every community and how we need to actually help protect children. I'm a child rights activist and this movie just shows what we need to do to protect our children and to protect our future. Thank you. Where are we heading? Okay, I'm going to say I am so excited. I'm really short of words. I don't know what to say now because it was a massive crowd that came to support me. I want to say thank you to all my fans. Thank you so much. Thank you for being there for me. Thank you so much. I don't do you know what to say again. I'm a PR guru, really. How do you feel? How do you feel? One thing is good what to support people. When you support them, they will support you. I always support every event. And I'm a PR person, so I was able to pull it together. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it.